Hey guys, welcome back to Beauty in the Bump. Today I'm going to be showing you some crafts that you can do while you're home with your kids. I know right now everyone's practicing social distancing and it can be a little rough not being able to take your kids out as much. So I just wanted to show you guys a few things that can help keep them entertained. Say hi, Ellie. Hi, are we doing class? The supplies that we'll need are a water bottle, a toilet paper roll, some sprinkles or rice, and some tape. And then what you're gonna do is pour sprinkles inside of the water bottle. Whoa. Good job. Whoa. You had some extras in there. And then you're going to put the lid on top and screw it tightly. And then you have a music maker. How cool is that, Ellie? Good. Wanna shake it? Now we are going to paint our music makers. Yeah. We just finished painting and now we're gonna let them dry so then we can add stickers. This next craft we're going to do is we're going to make a flower pot and a flower out of this bottle. You excited, Ellie? I'm Princess Anna. Oh, you're Princess Anna. Sorry, are you excited, Princess Anna? Yeah. Cool. For this craft, you're going to need a soda bottle, paint, straws, and either soil rocks or some kind of stuffing. I'm going to use Easter grass because that's what I have on hand. Okay. Parents, you're going to want to do this part for your kids because you don't want anyone to get cut unless you have bigger kids. Here we have this part, and this is going to be turned into our flower, Ellie. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. okay. What you're going to do is cut these and then leave them like an inch, inch and a half at the bottom. Now comes the straws. <gasps> We're gonna take some tape and tape them together. I'm gonna tape it in so it can stay standing up. Now we are going to take the grass and put it in. You wanna help me? Yeah. So you put on that side, put it in nicely. Time to paint the flower pot. Here. I'll pick orange. The last step is to secure the flower to the stem. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take some tape, because I don't have hot glue, but I probably would hot glue it if anything. Just tape it up. Here are our finished products. The last craft I wanted to show you is DIY bath paint. What you'll need for this is some liquid soap and food coloring. Usually I use baby soap, but I'm trying to conserve it right now, so I'm just gonna show you guys with some regular hand soap. Your first step is going to be pouring in some soap, however much you wanna use. I'm just gonna use a little bit for right now. And then put a few drops of food coloring. Put three. And Whisk it up. Here are two different colors, purple and red. I'm gonna put my girls in the bath and they're gonna have so much fun with this. They're gonna paint themselves, paint each other, paint the walls, and then I'm just gonna rinse it out after. Wow, Naya, I like paint. 
as you can see this will keep them entertained for a while it's really fun for them and then after all you have to do is rinse out the tub I hope you guys enjoyed these little crafts that we did for you today they're all pretty simple and I hope your kids enjoy them too if you do any of them please comment down below and let me know how they went and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel hi guys subscribe to my channel <laughs>